live on 2K Sports. Alongside Greg Anthony and Steve Smith with David Aldridge on the sideline, this is Kevin Harlan. We'll see the Cleveland Cavaliers and the Chicago Bulls. Look at Cleveland's starting group. LeBron James LeBron is out there with Gooden. Then there's Ogoskis. Then it's Sasha Pavlovich. And it's Hughes in at the point guard. And so it's the Cavaliers getting on the board first. Macy up top. The pass to Gerber. Shoots. And there's Jordan. That's good on the assist by Gervin. Yeah, nice timing there on that catch and shoot. Jordan with such a musical rhythm to his game. Outside, James. Pass to Hughes. Back to James. Shot clock at three. Cleveland needs to get a shot off here. Hughes, good. And one thing about Hughes, that man is always ready to shoot it. And here are the Bulls now. Outside Jordan. Passes it to Macy. Left side, Gervin. And some nice ball movement here by Chicago. Oakley passes to Gervin. Let's it fly. Got a piece of it. Low block shot on the way. Again, the Cavaliers score. And Hughes, a nice looking shot there. When the D gives him room to shoot, he does not hesitate. Green with a screen on Hughes. Macy passes to Gervin. It's Jordan on the wing. That's in, coming off the assist from Gervin. And I like to see this. They're calling his number early, and he's delivering. It makes sense, right? You're trying to get off to a fast start, and he can help with that. No good from LeBron. High percentage look for him. But bottom line, they're not all going to go down. Pass to Macy. From deep, Jordan. It's rebounded by Cleveland. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. And if there's one guy who's not afraid of contact, it's Oakley. Bulls shooting their first free throws of the game. For Chicago, Charles Oakley. Two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And he makes the first. I mean, Oak is as strong as an ox. Has that intimidating nature about him on both ends. Someone you just do not want to mess with. He's off on the second. And so James will bring it up for the Cavaliers. A pass to Hughes. And here in the first, approaching three minutes played. From 20 feet out, that's good on the jump shot. Hughes got six points. Now that's a high percentage look when the D doesn't fight over the screen. Reason why, it takes extra energy to do it. You have to trust your defensive rotations, but it's worth it. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. The Cavaliers shooting their first free throws of the game. down the first one.
And so he makes both from the line. First quarter of play, we're about three minutes in. Shot from the top of the key. And again, no good by Chicago. And he rushed that one, no doubt about it. The D out of position, you could see the frustration on his face. LeBron passes to Hughes. He kicks it to Pavlovich. Here's the three. Krill's the three-pointer. Pavlovich has got five now. And he's not going to miss that sort of an opportunity from D. Bulls trail by eight. Outside Oakley. Here's Jordan. And the Bulls with another miss. The defender took away the airspace, crowded him. That changed the shot. James looking it over. Pass to Hughes. Shoots over Macy. The shot by Hughes, no good. Guys are looking for a spark here. Yeah, a cold stretch offensively, for sure. Great energy on the deflection and a good job disrupting their offense. This is called an effort play. Terrific hustle at the defensive end. Oak Leaks to Gervin. Macy up top. Shot clock at six. Here's Jordan. That's in. Coming off the assist from Gervin. He has six. Talented, driven. He puts constant pressure on your defense. Passes to Good. James against Gervin. And that one's good, James. That's the right strategy. Get the ball to LeBron. Let him go to work. Up top, Oakley. Here's Jordan. Releases from the wing and drills it. Well, check out that assist. That's a pair of teammates that are clearly on the same page. Hughes, the pass to LeBron. Here's Ilgoskis. And he drops in the layup off the glass. And I like how tenacious Ilgowskis is. Once he catches the ball, he feels like no one is stopping. Pass to Macy. He dishes it to Green. Kicks it out to Jordan. Connects from three-point range. Jordan's got 11 points. Cleveland leading by five. There's Pavlovich. He's got five. The pass to Hughes. And there's the whistle. Illegal screen. And not the most common call you'll see in the NBA, but hard to argue that pick wasn't illegal. It's often a tough call that can go either way, but I agree with you on that one. Anderson Barajow's checked in for Cleveland. Here's Macy. Hasn't made one yet. Jordan passes to Macy. Gervin against LeBron. Pass to Jordan. Wide open look. And a rebound goes to the Cavaliers. Woo, that's just a case of bad defense and even worse offense. Hughes with it. Six points for him. Another three for Cleveland. And when Hughes knocks down threes, he is a major headache for the opponent. Passes it to Green. Michael Jordan on the wing. Pavlovich with the rebound. The Cavaliers leading by eight. Pass to Hughes. LeBron James on the wing. The 10 footer. And there's another one for the Cavaliers. Yeah, they, they have gone full throttle from the opening tip, showing no signs of letting up. Already ahead by double digits, trying to run away and not look back. Here's Jordan. And the Bulls with another miss. Both sides attacking. That was good defense versus good offense. And here is Hughes. He's got nine. And there's the pass to Pavlovich. 
good, and the assist goes to LeBron. Pavlovich has got a pair of threes now in the first quarter for Cleveland. They've been looking out of sync offensively. Yeah, the, their offense has ground to a standstill. Will it go? That's tipped, and they'll keep possession. Bulls moving the ball around. Here's Jordan. Fades away and sinks the tough shot. Jordan's got 13. And no one has better natural scoring tools. But, but another thing that really sets MJ apart, the acute instincts he brings to the table. Hughes against Mason. Hughes, the pass to James. And they double up LeBron. Launches it. The shot by Hughes, no good. Bulls trail by 11. Now Macy, still without a basket. Pass to Jordan. Shoots. And it's Chicago scoring again. That's the pass you want. Orchestrating the offense, creating for others. Here's Hughes. Pass to James. And they double up James. Pass to Gooden. Kicks it to Pavlovich. Now the pass to LeBron. Offline with his three. From 17 feet out, Michael Jordan again. He's got 17. And when we think about the excitement that Jordan brings to the game, but, but what about the offensive fundamentals? The, the, the man is a perfectionist. Now here's LeBron. He's got six. The Cavaliers with another miss. And that is the exact type of opportunity this offense is looking to create. You know, if you get the ball to the right guy in the right spot, more often than not, you're coming away with points. Here's Jordan. 17 points in the game. The Bulls need to get a shot off. Here's Gervin. It's hauled in by Gooden. Gooden's got his fifth rebound in this one. Hughes with it. He's got nine. He kicks it to Pavlovich. Trying to get something going. It's hauled in by Oakley. Oakley's got rebound number five here tonight. Macy passes to Jordan. Verizhao against Oakley. Pass to Green. That's in, coming off the assist from Durbin. Durbin's got four assists in the game. There's a minute 34 left in the first quarter. Let's it go from the wing. That's another one for him. It is fifth in just seven shots. 124 left in the first. Now, here's Jordan. He started closer, and he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. That's on LeBron James. And the defining trait of the greatest of superstars, Jordan makes the players around him better, mentally, in terms of effort, and in terms of their performance. Bulls shooting their third free throw shot of the game. So Chicago going with an almost entirely new group. Fields checked in. Corzine comes in for Green. Banks checked in for Gervin. And it's Paxson in for Kyle Mason. Find the lanes. Find the lanes. One shot. One fifteen left here in the first quarter. Outside Gibson. Marshall sets a screen for Gibson. Misses the three. Bulls trail by four. Outside Banks fields the pass to Paxson. Fifty seconds left to play here in the first. Six to shoot. Passes it to Corzine. It's rebounded by Cleveland. 
In the corner, Gibson with it. This one for three. Good on the three-point shot. And the Cavaliers lead by seven. Yeah, and Gibson, a dangerous shooter. You, you can't let him get going from deep. That's just inviting trouble. Pass to Jordan over Gibson. And again, Chicago, no good. And here's Cleveland. The pass to James. Three, Marshall. And no luck with that time on the buzzer beater. And so it's the Cleveland Cavaliers bringing the quarter to a close with a seven-point lead. They're shooting the ball so well in this one. A great performance from the field. We'll return shortly. And for those of you just tuning in, the second quarter of action is where we're at right now. And a moment to look at the scoring approach in terms of where the points are coming from for Cleveland. They came out firing from deep. It's always good for a team's confidence when you can start a game that hot. And one other thing they've done well today, guys, share the ball. I mean, set up teammates and just playing unselfishly. And so Jordan will bring it out for the Bulls. They trail by seven. And so in the game for the Cavaliers, Snow out there with Daniel Gibson. Then it's LeBron James. Then there's Anderson Vergeau. And it's Marshall in at the four slot. And the dunk by Jordan. And there are nights it really doesn't matter what you do defensively. MJ is going to score. And this is looking like one of those nights. James good. And that assist got him a little nod from his teammate after that one. James has gone one of two, shooting from three. Pops it up for Jordan. Out of bounds. Cleveland will take possession. Yeah, just not on the same page. Unfortunate, wasted possession. Number 10, Michael Fulton. The Cavaliers leading by eight. Outside Gibson, the three. And another three for Cleveland. Gibson. Yeah, Snow, terrific job there. Just kind of setting the pace. Exceptional at breaking down the defense with his passing. Holton passes to Jordan. Good ball movement here by the Bulls. Drills it from outside. Both teams running perimeter-oriented plays that are working. How often do we see this these days? Clubs answering each other from range. Snow the pass to Gibson. LeBron with it. Defended by Jordan. And they double up James. Three, Marshall. Now on the scoring column with that bucket. One for two this game. Of the two offenses here tonight, you can tell theirs is just a bit more in sync. They've had better patience, better shot selection so far, but we still have a long way to go. And it's good, two points. Paxson's got five points now in the quarter. And that smooth, fluid, just all-in-one-motion jump shot there. Paxson seems to get the best rhythm on it when someone's setting him up. Very Zhao with a screen on Paxson. No good from Gibson. Bulls trail by nine. The feed to Jordan. The rebound by Gibson. He goes up strong, but he is met with resistance. I think that surprised him a little bit. LeBron passes to Snow. Outside Gibson. To the paint. Here's Ferrajal. And it's slammed in by Ferrajal. I mean, maybe he could have tried for a more memorable dunk than that one. And we know he's capable of those memorable ones. Now, here is Jordan. He's got 22. Here's Corzine. And the dunk by Corzine. And once you get the height advantage from there, no need to mess around. The Cavaliers leading by nine. Pass to Marshall. Knocked away. On the wing, James. Shot. 
Here's Holton, defended by Gibson. Here's Jordan. It's rebounded by Cleveland. 13 points was their biggest lead in the game. Gibson in the post. Passes to Marshall. On the wing, James. Another three for Cleveland. Tough to be that consistent from range for that long. LeBron defying the odds. And just over three and a half minutes played here in the second quarter. There's the pick. Here's Holton. Another one falls for Chicago. And it's the Cavaliers with the ball. Ten-point lead. It's time now to hear from our Hall of Fame reporter, David Aldridge. What's the latest, David? Thank you, Kevin. Now, defense wins championships, but offense is winning over the league, with efficiency reaching new heights year by year. Now, different explanations exist, but one thing is clear. In an era of floor spacing, there are elite players, a lot of them, who are having a field day exploiting all that room to operate. Kevin? Boy, they sure are, David. Well put. Thank you. Here's LeBron following the three-point basket by Chicago. Marshall sets a screen for Gibson. Trying to come right back with the three of his own, but it's no good. Jordan deciding where to go with it. And two free throws coming up, unable to get that one to go with all the content. He made the only free throw attempt he had earlier in the game. At the line for Chicago, Michael Jordan. Two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. First one falls for it. Both teams deciding to change it up. He makes one of two that time. The Cavaliers leading by six. Here's Pavlovich. Eight points for him. Cleveland moving it around. Let's the three fly. Good, and the assist goes to LeBron. James has got three assists now in this one. That's why people want to play with LeBron. He's always creating good looks for his teammates. Gibson against Mason. Here's Jordan. The 17-footer goes down. Jordan's got five points now this quarter. Now that's a high percentage look when the D doesn't fight over the screen. Reason why, it takes extra energy to do it. You have to trust your defensive rotations, but it's worth it. Now here's LeBron. He's got 12. Pass to Ogoskis. Over Oakland. Ogoskis, good. And the Cavaliers lead by nine. I love it. Beautiful job getting to the rim, making a play. Macy against Gibson. And here is Macy. No scoring in this one. It's blocked. Thanks against James. James jackhammers it down. Oh, a guy as big as LeBron can handle the ball that well is a mystery. And here's Jordan. He'll bring it up for Chicago. 11-point game to the inside. And Charles Oakley out there with the slam. Strong move to the 10, trying to get his guys going. Hard not to get motivated, G.A., right when your teammate makes that kind of play. The problem is your opponent is making big plays as well. I'll be curious to see the response. Now, here is Ogauskas. Count the bucket, and he's got a free throw coming up as well. And those are the kind of nice inside looks they've got here in the first half. 
He's getting his first free throw attempt of the game here. Gervin's checked in for Chicago. And Cleveland with a change here, too. Hughes is checked in. Free throw good, Ilgowskis. And no doubt the size of Ilgowskis can be intimidating. He, he is a huge player with a surprisingly soft touch. And three from Jordan. It's rebounded by Cleveland. LeBron passes to Hughes. Floats it up for James. And now here comes Gervin leading the break. Macy, that's good. And they need those kind of plays right now. Smart defense that generates some oak. The pass to Hughes. Back to James. Over Gervin. And LeBron gets LeBron. it to go with the assist by Hughes. Hughes got three assists in the game. to Green. It's Jordan on the wing. He's got 25. Macy from outside off the mark. The Cavaliers leading by 12. Passes it to Hughes. James in the post. Working on Gervin. Pavlovich kicks to Gooden. Shot clock at five. Pavlovich passes to Hughes for the three. Green with the rebound. Green's got four rebounds in this game. Irvin with the ball. He's picked up by LeBron. Good D by James. And you have to like how they're moving the ball right now. Snappy passes to ready shooters. It's basketball 101. But oh boy, is it working. Bulls trail by 12. Inside. Shot's good by Oakley. Oakley's got five now. Yeah, and this is what happens when you have a scorer like Jordan on the floor. He attracts all that attention defensively, leaving guys wide open. Here's Pavlovich. He's got 11. Feeds it to Gooden. Pass to Hughes. LeBron outside. The shot. Green with the rebound. Green's got five rebounds tonight. Jordan against Hughes. Here's Macy. Here's Gervin. No good there, and that would have cut it to single digits. Pavlovich dishes to James. He feeds it to Gooden. Good, and the assist goes to James. Gooden's got his first points of the game. Trying to attack the heart of that defense with great teamwork. Up top, Oakley. Jordan is doubled. Outside, Green. Here's Oakley. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. And, and with the offense getting right to the rim, at least they saved the layup. He'll take his third and fourth free throw shots of the game right here. Two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And the first one at the line is good. Banks checked in for Jordan. Both free throws good from Oakley. Cleveland leading by 10. 
LeBron outside, and the pass to Hughes. Back to James. Pass to Hughes. Three-pointer. It's hauled in by the Bulls. Oakley's got rebound number eight now on the night. And there's the feed to Gervin. Gets it down to single digits. I mean, the number of points they've scored in the paint already here is eye-opening. Hughes, the pass to James. Shoots over Banks. Strong inside. What a move by James. Don't let the analytics fool you. LeBron knows the importance of the mid-range shot. And Masics to Gervin. There's 49 seconds left in the first half. The short one's on the money. Gervin's got four points this quarter. Silky smooth. I tell you, Gervin can make it look as easy as a free throw, but defensively, boy, is he difficult to stop. James. Ah, oh, LeBron finishes inside with authority. I love that they're continuing to attack despite being up big. I'm impressed with their intensity tonight. They came in focused and they executed. This is the shot you want to get him. An open look from range. Just two seconds between shot clock and game clock. Now Hughes, 11 points in the game. Passes to LeBron. No good with the layup. And so it's LeBron James making things happen for the Cavaliers. He totaled 14 points in the quarter. He's given them all the offense they need right now. Back to the action in just a minute. And we've got third quarter of basketball for you. Two quarters in the books. What a game we're seeing from Michael Jordan. Man, he's been running wild on him through that first half. Absolute dynamite on offense. This is his challenge to continue to dominate, to help them try to close strong here in the second half. And here's Jordan. He'll bring it up for the Chicago Bulls. They trail by seven. They've got Macy. Green is out there with Oakley. Then there's Gerber. And it's Jordan in at the two. That's the group for Alexi Morris getting going here in the second half. Macy against Hughes. Clock at four. Here's Green. It's blocked. Yeah, and Ilgowska stretching out there to block shots. Superb at using that huge wingspan to come up with rejections. Now here's LeBron. That one doesn't drop. Good work defensively by Gervin. Here's Jordan. And he lays it straight in. Jordan's got the first points to start out the third quarter for the Bulls. And you can just see the extraordinary competitiveness. MJ staying laser focused after absorbing the contact. Here's Hughes. No one near James as he lets it go. And the three ball is good. James has got 23. Putting consistent pressure on this defense. Just the threat of him out there makes this offense work. Here's Gervin. Hits the layup after the sweet pump fake to freeze the D. 
And, and you got to love the big bucket in the paint in this sort of a grind it out game. Hughes, the pass to James. Just over a minute and a half played here in the third. Bulls trail by six. Down low. Here's Macy. The rebound by Hughes. Mm, I'm not sure what happened on that play. May have relaxed a little bit once he got to the rim. Ilgowskis in the post. And by Green. Ilgowskis. Good. Ilgowskis has got nine. Really, the defense is helpless to stop a layup right there. Just too much of an advantage in terms of the mismatch. Jordan dishes to Oakland. That one drops for him. He's got nine. A little under two and a half minutes gone by here in the third. Here's Pavlovich. He's got 11. Pass to Hughes. Over Macy. The shot by Hughes, no good. Chicago trailing here. Here's the pass to Jordan. That's in, coming off the assist from Gervin. Gervin's got his seventh assist in the game. You know, I have to say, that's about as smooth as you can do it. Fantastic turnaround. Hughes against Mason. From the line, the shot by Hughes, no good. I didn't see that miss coming. I mean, he's usually been money from that range. Michael Jordan on the wing. Outside, Green. Good ball movement here by the Bulls. Outside, Jordan. Let's go. Pass to Macy. From outside the arc, bangs home the trifecta. And now just a one-point Cavalier lead. We know he has the range, and we know he has the attack mindset. And right now, let's watch that terrific SWAT team. And guys, that is lockdown defense at its finest. Going right at the shot and then able to knock it away. Here's James. 23 points in the game. Passes it to Pavlovich. Here's LeBron. There's the three. The Cavaliers again can hit. Well, it's definitely within striking distance now. Yeah, look, they've got to make each possession count on both sides of the floor. And they take the lead. Jordan's got the lead up to one now for the Bulls. LeBron outside. Pass to Hughes. to James. Shot clock at six. Now the pass to good. Here's Pavlovich. Trains it from beyond the arc. Pavlovich has got 14 points. Now here's Jordan. He's got 31. Here's Green. The Cavaliers pull it in. 13 points was their biggest lead in the game. Pass to Hughes. It's up a three. It's hauled in by Oakley. Oakley's got rebound number 12 here already in the game. Macy passes to Green. Michael Jordan on the wing. And they double up Jordan. Back to Green. The dish to Jordan. Four on the shot clock. Outside Oakley. Here's Gervin. Uses the glass that time, and it's good. Gervin's got the game tied up here for the Bulls. And the Iceman, he might have the biggest toolbox of anybody. He's got so many weapons, and he just has a tremendous instinct for scoring the ball. Hughes against Mason. James left side. Uncovered. Michael Jordan grabs the miss. He had it rolling and then lost it for some reason. Let's see if he can get it back while it still matters. 
And Charles Oakley out there with the slam. Great game for him. Double double down. 11 points and 12 rebounds. Hughes with it. 11 points in the game. This is to James. Over Gervin. A nice shot by LeBron. LeBron's got five points now in the quarter. It's been a pleasure, as always, to watch LeBron work. A truly gifted player. And now the Cavaliers. Fast break. And the defense to start that play was terrific. I love the fact that they attacked early in the shot clock. Outside Oakley. Here's Jordan. Cavaliers with the rebound. James has got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. And here is Hughes. 13 points in the game. Shoots over Macy. Here's Ilgoskis. Good on the shot. Man, that's a lesson for the D. Fight harder on the glass. Reason why, lack of focus, lack of communication, which led to second chance points. And a chance for just a second to check out the scoring breakdown for the Cavaliers. They are making it rain from the three-point land right now. And the coaching staff continues to encourage them to let it fly. And something else that stands out is how efficient they've been from the mid-range, making the most of their opportunities. Free throw good, Ilgowskis. Bulls trail by five. Now Macy. He's got eight. Feeds it to Oakley. And he converts the layup. Oakley's got six here in this quarter. And even if you risk a foul, the D has to play him tougher when he gets it that deep. And if you don't, they keep finding the matchup every time up the floor. Here's Pavlovich. He's got 14. Fires for three. Chicago grabs the miss. Oakley's got 13 rebounds in the game. Seated. Here's Green. Nails the baby hook. Now just a one-point Cleveland lead. At the end of the day, when the ball goes up, there's no substitute for effort. Gibson passes to Hughes. Cleveland moving it around. Outside Gibson. Ilgowskis against Oakley. Second chance effort. And it's Ilgowskis missing. And not allowing the shooter even an inch of breathing room on that one. And you know we always talk about this. Just changing the shot can be just as effective as blocking it even though it's less spectacular. And the Cavaliers with possession here. George Gervin missing his last shot. Here's Hughes. And another field goal in his total. Make it 7 for 14, shooting 50%. And that pick takes the D totally out of the equation. Hey, if you're not going to fight over, you're essentially giving the shooter the look he wants. Macy against Gibson. And the call will be against Zildrunas Ilgowskis. And that'll be his third foul so far. Anderson Verizhaus checked in for Cleveland. Team foul. Cavalier substitution. Number 17, Anderson Verizhaus. Here is Oakley. 13 points in the game. Lock at six. Macy with it. Now guarded by Gibson. Macy, that's good. I mean, that's a good job working the ball inside and getting a quality shot. Cavaliers leading. Hughes with it. 15 points in the game. 8 for 15 with that made basket. But he's not satisfied yet. Hughes against Gervin. Passes it to Macy. And here is Green. And he makes that one. Green's got four points now in the quarter. Here's Hughes. 17 points in the game. And oh, 
Oh boy, a lot of contact there, but he gets the call and will shoot two. I mean, even from over here, you can see that one pretty clearly. This is his first free throw of the game. Cavaliers, Larry Hughes. Two shots. Shooting two. First free throw is good. And the Bulls making a change here. Corzine's checked in, and Cleveland making a change here. And he makes both free throws. And Chicago has possession. It's a three-point game. Outside Banks. Here's Oakley. Yes, once again, it remains perfect. Six attempts and six hits. I like what he's doing here. Terrific efficiency scoring the basketball. Pass to Marshall. And there's the pass to Verja. And the corner gets him with it. Marshall sets a screen for Gibson. Going inside, and he finishes nicely on the layup. Gibson's got eight. A little artistry in the painted area, converting against the size. Proving once again that when you attack with confidence, good things tend to happen. Snow against Mason. Outside Banks, two on the clock. Let's it go. Count it. And the Cavalier lead has been cut down to just one on the bucket from Gervin. And some kind of switch must have been flipped at halftime because both teams are getting after it. I would have loved to hear the coach's speech because they really took heed to it. Like you said, both teams playing at a different pace. For three, a three-pointer is right on target. Hughes got 22 points. And just no excuse, guys, for leaving a shooter like him open beyond the arc. Macy passes to Banks. And here is Macy. He's covered by Snow. Oakley is screen on Snow. Here's Macy. Goes back up. Tries yet again. A shot by Corzine, no good. The Cavaliers leading by four. Gibson dishes to Marshall. Charles Oakley grabs the miss. Oakley's got rebound number 15 here tonight. Good! Kervin's got eight points in the quarter. Just taking what the defense allows, and that's a shot he'll make all night. And he got that one up in time, but doesn't go in. We're at the end of the third, and we've still got a close one. He went ahead, leading by just two. And when we return, we'll get the fourth quarter rolling right here on 2K Sports. In a moment now as we take a look at our State Farm assists of the game. Just true artistry right there. I mean, great decision on where to go with the ball. And how about the perfect delivery? Execution. This is what you practice every day. These guys are professionals. Beautiful play. And with these teams locked in a very close contest, this fourth quarter promises to be a good one. And Cleveland looking at who they've got to start the fourth quarter. They've got Hughes. He's out there with Daniel Gibson. Anderson Verja out there with LeBron James. And it's Marshall in at the fourth spot. First, 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 first team foul. At the line for the Cavaliers, Larry Hughes. Two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. That 
that one is off. So neither attempt will fall that time for Chicago trailing here. Here's Holton. Jordan high post. Paxson outside. Pass to Jordan. And they double up Jordan. Picks it out to Banks. To tie it up. And the Bulls tap on two more. And that's right in his wheelhouse, looking to make an impact when it counts. It's the fourth quarter, and it's a close game. You want to get the ball to someone you can rely on. Pass to Hughes. From downtown, trains the three-pointer. Hughes got 25 points. And they have been relentless from deep. And you see the defense trying to react, but to no avail. You know what? They talked about this at halftime. And they're doing a better job of creating space. Here's Holton. Pass to Baxton. Here's Jordan. It's rebounded by Cleveland. Empty possession. And you don't want to miss these easy looks. Gibson passes to Marshall. Here's Hughes. Shot's good. Marshall making the play. And it's a six-point Cavalier lead. If you came to watch a scoring battle, you're in the right place. Yeah, both teams trying to close out strong. These are the fireworks that fans came to see. Now, here's Jordan. No good from the wing. Game moves along. Two minutes gone here in the fourth. Hughes kicks to Marshall. On the wing, James. Oh, good on the triple. And so here is Chicago. Paxson passes to Holden. To the middle, here's Corzine. And a rebound goes to the Cavaliers. LeBron's got his fifth rebound in this one. Here's Gibson. The layup off target. Bulls trail by six. Takes a step back. Holton passes to Jordan. And he gets the bucket. Jordan's got 35. The yeah, high percentage look for Jordan. It has every move you could ask for in the painted area. Timeout call the Cavaliers. Well, it's a player's lead, but certainly coaching has its place. Yeah, if that weren't the case, you wouldn't see so many coaching changes in the offseason. Charles Oakley is checked in for the Bulls. Okay, then for the Cavaliers, Ilgauskas is checked in for Marshall. And it's Snow in for Larry Hughes. With a short break in the action, gives us a chance now to send it over to David Aldridge. Hey guys, during the break, listened in to Mike Brown. Now they've been happy with the way the team is shooting. He reminded players to keep taking those threes, that they've had some clean looks. And when that three goes in, it's always a welcome sight. Guys? Thank you, David. A little over two and a half minutes have passed here in the fourth quarter. Here's LeBron. The Cavaliers again can't hit. Bulls trail by four. Paxson outside. Here's Jordan. The rebound by James. LeBron's got six rebounds now in the game. To the inside, Ilgauskas and the jam by Ilgauskas. <laughs> and not a long trip to the rim for Ilgauskas, using that reach to just hammer it down. Paxson outside. The pass to Oakley. And he uses the glass on the lane. Nice job getting inside for the layup. Got the deep thinking jump shot. Gave a little pump fake and then off to the races. LeBron passes to Verizon. LeBron outside. 
nifty move. And the dunk by James. How about that one from LeBron James? That was nice. Now here's Paxson. That's to Oakland. Inside. And the dunk by Corsi. Oh, an aggressive move and fantastic finish. Mm -hmm. Trying to send a message with that slam, I think. Verizhao finds Gibson. Here's Snow. Passes it to Verizhao. Six on the shot clock. Now here's Gibson. Beyond the arc. Gets the three-pointer to fall. Gibson. And the Cavaliers lead by seven. Yeah, coming down the stretch, they've become reliant upon their perimeter game. You know, when you're raining threes, you can stack up points in a hurry. But it can go the other way as well. Here's Oakley. That drops and it comes off an assist from Jordan. Jordan's got five assists in the game. Outside Gibson. Verishow setting the pick for Gibson. A three-pointer, no good. Now the Bulls with it. Banks dishes to Jordan. Over Augustus. Jordan's shot is off. The Cavaliers leading by five. Here's Snow. Outside Gibson. And there's the call on Michael Jordan. That is his first foul of the game. And the Cavaliers making a change here. Substitution on the court. Hughes against Mason. And there's the whistle. Three-second violation. Bulls trail by five. And here is Jordan. And the Bulls tied up, so we'll have a jump ball. That's a jump ball. Here's LeBron, and LeBron throws it down hard. And what an explosive finisher LeBron is, rocking the rim whenever he goes up like that. Chicago with the ball. They trail by seven. Pass to Green. That one goes. Count it. Resourceful move there. That, that was not an easy one to convert. Especially given the high disadvantage. I love the way he created space for his shot. Now here's LeBron. Now Hughes. Five on the clock. Here's LeBron. Over to the wing. Here's Pavlovich. Good, and the assist goes to LeBron. And the Cavaliers lead by eight. Defensively, you have to tighten up on him or suffer the consequences. AC passes to Jordan. It's rebounded by Cleveland. Gooden's got rebound number 11 for him here tonight. The pass to Hughes. Floats it up for James. Yeah, I just love how alert Hughes is. Super talented guard who knows when one of his guys is open. Jordan on the wing over Pavlovich. And it hung on the rim but wouldn't fall for him. James outside. Pass to Hughes. From deep, another three for Cleveland. 
He is cold-blooded. Drops the dagger. Piles on to what was already a big lead. I mean, defensively, if you have any hope of coming back in this game, you can't afford to give him those looks. And Green swims it in. And he's now got the double-double. Ten points and ten rebounds. Doing his job on the glass and doing it with force. And Greg, it's not everybody in the league who can make those kinds of plays. You know, this is one of his specialties, keeping plays alive, creating second-chance opportunities. And here is Macy, following the basket by LeBron James. Down low. Green, no luck. The Cavaliers leading by 13. Hughes with it. To the paint. He's looking for LeBron and finds it. And that one, good. LeBron's got 15 points in just the second half. Going right at him. LeBron made up his mind. Hughes against Mason. Passes to Jordan. Jordan is double. Oakley. Gooden with the rebound. Now here's James. Pass to Ogalskis. Here's Pavlovich. And the pass to Hughes. Launches a three. Chicago grabs the miss. Green's got 11 rebounds in the game. Now here's Jordan. Guarded close. And a wide open look for Gervin. And it's good assisting on the play with Jordan. Jordan's got six assists in the game. And here's James. He'll bring it up for Cleveland. And they double up James over Gervin. And that one hits back iron. Once he gets the ball there, you expect him to capitalize. That was a missed opportunity. Macy against Hughes. And here is Macy. Gooden with the rebound. Gooden's got 14. Yep, 14 rebounds for him tonight. Wow. Here's LeBron. And another miss by Cleveland. Bulls trail by 12. Gervin in the post. Hughes covering. Gervin passes to Macy. Here's Jordan. Again, Chicago. I like that approach, playing inside out, forcing the defense to scramble. Timeout called Cleveland. They're up by 10. A minute 20 left in the fourth quarter. A minute 20 left here in the fourth quarter. He gets it in there. Hughes got 33 points. The defense late to react. A beautiful play we just saw. Here's Jordan. It's rebounded by Cleveland. Missed opportunity. It's a makeable shot for him. He just can't get it to go. Pass to Hughes. Back to LeBron. Lock at six. The jump hook, and the shot goes in. LeBron's got 37. Taking no chances. They go on one last run to seal the deal. Not messing around at all. They were focused, relentless, and they got the job done. Kervin for three. It's rebounded by Larry Hughes. Shot clock and game clock separated by less than six seconds. Passes it to Good. Cleveland moving the ball around. Outside Jordan. Here's Kervin. That drops and it comes off an assist from Jordan. And we always talk about making your teammate better. That assist was right on target. James outside. 
so we see the Cavaliers taking the win here. This was a very strong showing for him, Greg. Not necessarily a runaway win, but one they'll feel very good about. And let's face it, any time you can go on the road and win in the fashion they did, you have to feel good about it. Really an outstanding effort all the way around. And that'll do it, folks. Now for Greg Anthony, Steve Smith, and David Aldridge. This is Kevin Harlan. Thanks for watching the NBA here on 2K Sports. Right now, let's take a look at the New Balance Player of the Game.